This snack over here is doing my fucking head, isn't it? <laughs> Every time I walk past, I'm like, take the piss out of me, brother, he's a nubbit. I, I, I understand, people like, uh, people see the videos and they're like, oh, I want to I get the piss out of me and I don't want to be involved in the show. The cunt's got a t-shirt with my face on. <laughs> saying, abuse me if you dare. What kind of a horrible, pathetic fucking loser cunt? How interesting do you think you fucking are? Stags are cunts. Honestly, I wish I was a woman. Because hen's a boss. Because my missus went on a hen. She went on a fucking spa weekend. All the mates bought a lovely fucking pyjamas and that. My stag, fuck me, la. It's just an ounce of MDMA and I cried for a week after it. As soon as you get on the stag, everyone's just like, ruin his life, ruin his life. This fella come up to me once, right? And he went, oh, we're in with the stag. I'm the father-in-law. His name's dad and he's a bit of a knobhead, right? He's just got a, his last relationship, he can't see his kids anymore. And I was like, what the fuck am I supposed to do here? <laughs> How am I meant to bridge that gap there? How am I meant to walk on and go, oh, we've got a dad in an Abby. Hello, Abby Stag. Heard you can't see your kids anymore. <laughs> if I was ruthless to him, all his mates would be fucking made up. I could say anything to him. And his mates would go, yeah, he's right, you're a cunt. Hens, mate. I swear to God, you say one thing to a hen and they're like, you fucking leave her alone. <laughs> she is a princess. This is a special day. You get away from her, you get away from her. I'm like, fucking hell. I'm only trying to finger it in pot world, do you know what I mean?